eating a whole pizza by myself right now. Get a small one. Oh, do they have small pizzas? Yeah, they're great. All right. And that was Should I get a pepperoni or a mushroom pizza? Gourmet scum. Melanie. Ta-da! Right no more braces. All right. You improved. Melanie Brody is ready for action. <laughs> I want to talk a little about Hi, Caitlin. <clears throat> Why don't you just admit that you still like him? He obviously still likes you. Oh, hi. Hey, wow, your braces are off. Isn't it fantastic? Let's celebrate. Cokes, pizzas, whatever you want. It's all on me. Oh, hey. Hey. This is good to me. Right, Mom. All right. All right. Wake up in the morning, feeling shine on the tree. I gotta go to the school. Take this up again tomorrow. Class dismissed. That was Tell me about it. So thanks for treating yesterday. My mom was so mad that I spent all that money. Well, it was 20 bucks. Yeah, but it's my money. I can do what I want. So are you guys going to the Gourmet Scum concert next month? Tickets go on sale this weekend. No, thanks. I hate the Gourmet Scum. Me too. Well, I think they're great. I couldn't go even if I wanted to. I am totally broke. <laughs> Hi, Kathleen. How are you feeling? None of your business. How do you think she's doing? I don't know. I did see her at lunch yesterday. I'll see you guys outside. Bye. Okay, bye. The gourmet scum. <laughs> The music department has asked me to announce our school band so what's now a has a position available for it's a new tuba player. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hey, girls. Did I tell you how beautiful you both look today? We don't talk to eighth graders. What a coincidence. Neither do I. Do you want to get together for a milkshake? We use three straws. Give it a rest, Joey. Joey Jeremiah. Mr. Studley. They're just playing hard to get, man. Chicks are crazy about me. They have to be crazy. When was the last time you ever had a date? With my charisma, you have to be selective. Nah, you gotta be defective. Oh, very funny. 20 bucks says you can't get a date for Friday. <laughs> me? Please. 20 bucks. Or your chicken? <sighs> okay, you're on. Easiest 20 bucks I'll ever make. That last announcement should have been for three cheaper players. Thank you. Snake buddy, listen. It's so funny. BLT bet me 20 bucks that I couldn't get a date for Friday night. Is that a joke or what? Friday? You're lining up with us to get gourmet scum tickets. Oh, man, I forgot. I can't back out of a bet. You gonna ask Caitlin? Yeah, I wish. So will you get me the ticket if I give you the box? Oh, they only let you buy two tickets each. One, two, what's the problem? Well, I was sort of thinking of bringing a friend. Here she comes, come on, get lost. I wanna watch, this might be fun. Joey, get lost, come okay, on. Okay, okay, no sense of humor. won't let me go to a concert. They're scared I'll get corrupted or something. Yeah. Well, I have to go to my locker and get my Melanie? lunch. Hi, Snake. Um, I was wondering if, um, 
If you were going to the uh, Gourmet Scum concert next month, uh, maybe you wanted to go together. Sure. Really? Really? Great. Um, only problem is, though, I only have enough money for one ticket. Uh, they're 20 bucks. No problem. Really? Uh, great. Um, uh, I'll buy the tickets Friday. I, I, I can bring the money tomorrow. Really? Great. Great. Um, well, uh, I'm going to go now. Bye. They're like so gross. Wait, I'll get our tickets. My mom said it's okay as long as I go with my cousin. I can't wait. It's the first time I'm going out since Emma was born. I know. How'd you manage the money? Well, Shane's been really good with child support, so I've managed to save up my allowance. Can you believe it? I'm a mom, and my mom still gives me an allowance. I don't complain. Hey, Liz. How would you like to go out Friday with the coolest dude at Degrassi? Who? Who is going to Degrassi? Did I ever tell you what a great sense of humor you have? I mean, me, of course. Can't. I gotta line up for concert tickets. Anyway, I thought we were just friends. Right. Forgot. I can't wait for this time. It's gonna be so nice. much fun. It's the first time we've been together for so I long. Know. Hi. So, what did he want? Who? Oh, you mean snake. Melanie. Melanie. Mm. Just going to the gourmet scum concert together, that's all. Are you kidding? That's amazing. But I thought you hated them. Diana, I'm not going for the music. <laughs> no, all I need is 20 bucks because we're going Dutch. That still counts as a date, right? <laughs> it counts, it counts. <laughs> but where are you going to get the 20 bucks? From my mom. I had this mega baby steam job Saturday. So I can pay her back. This is perfect. I get my braces off and my entire life changes. I'm sorry. No. But mom. Kiddo, we've been through this before. Any treats you pay for with babysitting money. But I'm babysitting for the Lowski Saturday night. I can pay you back. What happened to last week's babysitting money? You no, know I spent it. You have to learn some financial responsibility. You should have thought of this earlier. But I didn't know about the concert earlier. I'm not trying to be a wicked witch. Things are very tight right now. Your father's behind again on the child support. The rent is due, there are groceries to buy. I'm sorry. There just isn't any money. Come on, girls, it'll be fun. Hey, Lucy, you look incredible today. And I mean that sincerely. Oh, what do you want, Joey? How would you like to go out Friday with the coolest dude at Degrassi? Let's nice try. I'd like to, but I can't. Oh, come on, man. The gourmet scum's gonna break up after this tour. It's the last chance we're gonna get to see him. <laughs> Just once. Don't pair. Won't make a difference. How would one of you gorgeous ladies like to go out with me Friday night? <laughs> Is he serious? <laughs> Look at that shirt. 
Let's finish the math assignment. This is your principal, Mr. Lawrence. No, I didn't understand. All students are reminded that when using the halls or stairways of this school, foul language and shouting should both be understood. We'll just copy. Hi. Listen, sorry, but I can't give you any child support this month. Why not? I'm broke. This is great. Just great. I'll give it to you next time, I promise. There was no way I could convince my mom. She acts like we're mega poor. Oh, no. Oh, yes. So listen, I know it took me ages to pay you back last time. Sorry, I'm broke, too. My parents think I'm too young to babysit, so I'll get to my allowance. Bye. Thanks. Hi, Melanie. Oh. Hi. Listen, you know how I'm going to the concert with Snake? Well, I'm kind of short of cash, so I was wondering if either of you could lend me 20 bucks for the ticket? Sorry, but last time it took you forever to pay me back. My allowance is on a diet. Greetings, ever-aspiring scholars. Well, so far this term, we have read three plays. Today, we're going to take a look at what common thread runs through all three. So you can't go. It's so unfair. I know. Shane's a pig. Well, if he doesn't have it, what can he do? I wish I had the money to lend you. Thanks. This is really depressing. Bye. Bye. Do you think he'll understand? Yes. Here he comes. It's not the end of the world, right? We can always go out somewhere else. Right. If he asks me out once, he's sure to ask me out again. Of course. Hi, Snake. Oh, hi, Melanie. Listen, um, I'm afraid... Afraid? ...that I forgot to bring the money today. I'll bring it tomorrow. Oh, fine. Great, um, great. I gotta go. Okay, bye. Hey, bye. Very impressive. I don't know how, Caitlin, but I have to go to this concert. Oh, I don't believe it. The proofs were supposed to be in at 2 o'clock. Oh. Hi, Mom. I'm home. Oh, hang on. Hi, kid. I'm on the phone. Can you run down to the corner store and get some milk? My purse is on the table. Sure. I'm back. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. It's insane. Well, look, um... Well, first thing Monday morning. What, what do you think? Yeah? Right. Um. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. It's insane. Yeah, well, look. Why don't we send it in first thing Monday morning? How about that? Um, no good. You think we should ask Wheels if he wants to come to the concert? What's the point? He never does anything anymore. He hardly even comes to school. Hey, Joey, don't forget about our little bet. You think I'd forget? I'll be there with my date. 20 bucks, man. Don't worry. By the way, bring new bills. I hate dirty money. <laughs> So, who you got for a date? Chicks. Who can figure them? You haven't got a date yet. Come on, ask her. She wouldn't go with me. Sure she would. Come on, try it right now. Upstairs. Okay. Come on, just go up to her, give her the hairy eye. Go, hey, Caitlin, come on. Let's, come on now. Go for it. 
Caitlin? Hi. Hello. Um, I was wondering, well, if you'd like to go out with me tonight. I mean a real date, seriously. Well, I guess, maybe. Really? It'll be my treat, okay? Okay, great. All right. Melanie. Hi. Guess who just asked me if... Joey? Uh-huh. <laughs> and I don't know, but he seems so vulnerable or something. Will your mom let you go? Um, she won't know. If I say I'm at your house, is that okay? Sure. Caitlin, this is so perfect. You and Joey, me and Snake. You got the money? How? From my mom. I thought she said no. She doesn't know about it. You mean you stole it? Borrowed it. I had to. And I'll put it back after I get paid for babysitting on Saturday. She'll never know. A reminder to attend next week's fire prevention seminar. Let's all work to keep oh, our okay, grassy environment oh, permanently smoke-free. You ever lined up all night for tickets? I haven't even been to a concert before. Who's all going? Uh, me, you, Snake, Shane. You'll love it, man. Everybody just talks. It's a party. Hey, Shane. How's it going? How are you doing? Yeah, what's up? Shane, Shane's going to the concert. What? I just heard Luke talking. He's so broke, how can he afford concert tickets? You liar. What? You said you couldn't pay child support because you were broke. Spike. How can you be broke if you're buying concert tickets? Well, why shouldn't I? I'm entitled to a life. I was going to go to the concert. So why should you go instead of me? It's my money. You get to go to parties and stuff. I have to take care of Emma. So I give you money all the time. And it's not to go to concerts either. I do all the work. Why can't I once just go out like any other 15-year-old? Well, why can't I? You know, you're lucky I'm nice. Lots of guys wouldn't give you anything. Liz was right. You are a pig. Let's get down to business, shall we? OK, we're going to start where we left off on, on page 194 on proportions. You can listen to the Easy Listening Hour on CRAZ Radio. I'm Justine Hockey. Hi, Mom. Hi, kiddo. You haven't seen a $20 bill around, have you? No. What? I'm sure I had three 20s, but I can only find two. I've racked my brains all day trying to think where it could be. I don't know what I'm going to do. I needed that money for groceries. Can't you get more out of the machine? <laughs> I can't get something that isn't there. You didn't take the wrong bill by mistake, did you, when you went to get milk? No. I'll get it. Don't worry, Mel. I'm sure the money will show up. Hello? Oh, hello. Yeah. Oh, you don't? No problem. OK, goodbye. Who was that? Mrs. Wolowski. She doesn't need me to babysit Saturday. Like that? 
I like the part when the cop came back and he had to pretend he was her mother. I thought that was kind of stupid. Hey, there's BLT and Michelle. Hey, what a coincidence. Hi. Okay, if we join you, we're on a date, you know. We just saw the best movie. Yeah, yeah. Um, does anyone want any Cokes or anything? Yeah, sure. My treat, I uh, feel kind of rich all of a sudden. No, you paid for the movies, the Cokes are on me. Okay, sure. I'll give you a hint. Great. When Joey Jeremiah says he'll deliver, he delivers. Yeah, yeah. So would you pair her or is she hypnotized? Hey, I don't need tricks. What chicks want, I got. Looks, style, and raw animal magnetism. <laughs> I don't know. I like So where's my box? Okay, okay. Um, pay me later, okay? No way, man. I pay my debts. You said you get a date for tonight, and you got a date. You win, fair and square. You asked me out on a bet? Not exactly. You asked me out on a bet? Caitlin, take it easy. I can't believe this. You got it all wrong. Yeah, I do. I changed my mind, Mr. Joey Jeremiah. The cokes are on you. Oh. Caitlin, wait! Caitlin, wait! Caitlin, the bet was just a joke! Oh, right! Really, I wanted to go out with you! Yeah, so you could win 20 bucks! No, I don't care about the money! You wanna see how much I care about the money? Joey! This is how much I care. Caitlin, the reason why I asked you out was because I wanted to go out with you. Joey, you could at least walk me home, even if you are a drip. You know, this stuff is really sticky. You deserved it. At least with this rain, I won't need a shower when I get home. How do you feel about chili all week? I like chili. Good. That's all we can afford. <sighs> I wish I hadn't lost that money. Mom, how come Dad's payments were late? I don't know. He probably doesn't have the money. I'm sure he'd send it if he did. He loves you, kiddo, just like I do. I thought I was doing so well, too. I was really proud of the way I was organizing the money. Then I go and lose $20 like a total idiot. You didn't lose the money, Mom. I'm grounded. What about the concert? I can't go. So much for everything being perfect. I might as well have kept the damn braces. How was your date with Joey? Different, but OK, I think. The music department announces that in response to widespread demand, the positions for three tuba players will not be filled. I'll see you. Hi, I got the tickets. Great, but I can't go. I'm grounded. What happened? Don't ask. I'm really sorry. What about the ticket? I'll sell it, I guess. Is there anyone else you'd like to go with? No. 
Maybe we can go out when I'm not grounded anymore. Maybe. Bye. Bye. And now my mom says she'll give me the money to buy a ticket and she'll take care of Emma. And now the concert's sold out. I know. I really wanted to go. Spike, do you want to buy a ticket? 20 bucks. <laughs>